iOS 11 released today, and in this video, I'm going to show you the iOS 11 screen recording in action. Did it live up to the hype? Let's get started. <laughs> Hi and welcome to Creator Fundamentals. My name is Dan Courier and I am here to help you build a foundation for YouTube success. So today when iOS 11 was released, my goal was to share a video with you direct from the new native screen recording feature. But I ran into a bit of disappointment. That's right, when I recorded this video on the new iOS 11 on my iPhone 7 Plus, uh, I was very disappointed to find out when I exported it, there was no sound. Even though there was sound in the Photos app on the iPhone and I could hear it, once it was exported to YouTube, there was no sound. So I'm going to try to walk you through this process. Here we are on this, the screen recording screen. A bit redundant, but that's where we are. Um, and what I want to show you is exactly how this works. So in the control center, you can see in the lower left-hand corner, there's a little blinking circle with a dot in it. That is the screen recording app. Now, when you first uh, do the install, uh, that was not present in the control center. So what you actually have to do is go into settings, control center, and then click on customize. And as you can see here, once you've done that, you have a bunch of different options you can add to the control center display. In this case, screen recording was at the bottom. I just clicked the green plus and that added it to the top and it appeared the way you see it here. So now if you click on this button and hold it down, it is going to bring you to an additional recording screen. If you just tap it quick, it just counts down and starts recording. But this is the additional recording screen. As you can see, there's a microphone audio on option. This basically allows you to record while you do a voice voiceover, which I originally done when I, I did when I recorded this video. However, that audio is not exporting with the video. It seems to me uh, like it is a bug. We will have to wait and see if this is something that Apple is going to fix. Otherwise, it really diminishes the value of the screen recording. One of the other things I wanted to note is that there are certain apps within uh, iPhone that uh, the sound recording is disabled, which I find a bit interesting that they'll let you record the game, but you know, presumably for copyright reasons, they're not letting you record the sound. So that is a bit of a disappointment. My thought was this would possibly be a great feature for people who wanted to do mobile gaming, but at the moment, you're going to have to create your own sound uh, overlay for any videos that you record in certain games. I haven't actually come across a game that you could record yet, but uh, there may or may not be some out there. But I did look at actual videos that you record on screen and you can hear the sound on those, but you can't export the sound. I hope that's something they fix quick uh, because it's a really a disappointment if that doesn't work. So I just wanted to share that with you. That's all for now. If you'd like to continue to build a foundation for YouTube success, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click that bell notification icon. My name is Dan Courier, and you're watching Creator Fundamentals. Thank you.